Welcome back to Let's Go Geo, everyone. Today it is time for another featured specimen, and we've got something a little different here today. So, the way this works is I show you the specimen off of my, out of my collection, or something I stumbled across in the field, and it's very cool. They're all very cool, all our featured Friday specimens um, for various reasons. As you can see, this one's super cool today, but your task is to guess what it is. See if you know what it is. Hopefully you've been watching my Let's Go Geo videos and you've been learning so much that you can make a pretty good guess. But it doesn't really matter if you get it right. I'll be doing a lot more videos down the line. So um, just take a guess, drop it in the comments and let's see what we think this is. And do your guess before we go into any more details about what it actually is. So I'll show you it for a while while you think and drop a guess below, and then we'll see what it is. So, you see these patterns here, kind of reddish colors there, but then on the side, you see kind of red bumps. So what is going on here? It's broken, I can tell you, it was, it was hammered out, um, part of it. Um, but this side here, can actually see lichen so that side was already exposed um, that means it was actually sitting around for a while because lichens take a long time to grow and there's those bumps we'll just call them bumps for now this one has some lines on it and look at the shape of that one it's pretty cool let's see some other perspectives so, what we're going to take a guess at today is is this reddish specimen. Just to be clear, you could guess the you could guess the what type of rock or anything. That's fine, but let's figure out what we think. What are these actual? What are these things? What are those red things in this rock? You could guess at what kind of rock it is too, based on maybe some background clues. So if we look at this, we see things that hopefully. Hopefully you thought you saw fossils because these are fossils. And this is what we would call fossiliferous. It's a fancy technical term by geologists that means there's a lot of fossils in it. And there are a lot of fossils in it. Um, all the red things that you see are, are fossils. And so hopefully you thought they looked like some kind of shell, like maybe like a seashell. And therefore you could guess that this rock is probably a limestone. That would be a good guess. This is a type of limestone that is filled with shell fossils. Um, now more specifically, these fossils, these are what we would call brachiopods. And the only way you can, I mean, you would, you would know that is by studying the different types of fossils that look like this, the different shelled organisms from the past. And you just get familiar with their the way that they look, their morphology, their shapes. And in this case, you can see specific shapes. Hard with one hand here. I'm holding this with one hand, but yeah, you can see specific shapes that you'd come to learn are features. Let's see that guy right there. Am I pointing to him? Yeah, you'd come to learn uh, to notice features that are specific to say brachiopods or ones that are not. So I'll be talking more about fossils here at Let's Go Geo. We talk about all kinds of things, everything that's interesting related to geology and geography. And we just look at large features and really small features and check them out in the field. Um, the main thing here is to see things in the field or to see actual specimens so you can get to know them firsthand. And it should help you in your fossil hunting, rock hounding, or just learning about geology, if that's something you're interested in. Um, so on Fridays, I do a featured specimen. And this is our featured specimen of today. But if you're interested in some of the cool things from my collection, or that I've stumbled upon in the field, then check out the featured Friday playlist, because I'll stick them all in there. And you can just check them out and learn about, hopefully, some new things that you haven't already seen. From these displays. 
otherwise we'll go on some more geo field trips here and i'll see you guys on the next adventure here at let's go geo